as Nigerians turn on Femi Adeshino, who has turned himself to someone everybody looks at, like some, you know, like somebody who has, uh, because of the few bread and the dollars that have been shown to him, okay, has neglected who he truly is or have no sense of belonging. He has released a statement saying, when has it become a crime to love Buhari? Are you listening? When, is it a, when has it become a crime to love Buhari, to love Nigeria and to love Igbos? If you look at that to love Igbos, it's more like an ironic statement, okay? Because he knows exactly what they are doing to the Igbos. He knows what is going on in Igbo land, how they are killing all the young men that should be the future, okay? He knows exactly what they are doing. And so he's saying that kind of words to spite the Southeasterners. I mean, even the Yorubas are tired of him. They've said, this man, we're not sure you are the son of your father. I mean, you know, when people are angry, they say anything and everything. Because this man looked at Olusegwa Basanjo in the face, you know, and said all kinds of things because he felt Olusegwa Basanjo was against Buhari. The words he said, even Yoruba elders and leaders had to ask him if he was all right. You see, so he's releasing a statement saying, when has it become a crime? You know, Femi Adeshino is saying, when has it become a crime to love Buhari? We know what you love is not Buhari. Uh, it's the dollar sign you've been shown. You know what comes, comes with uh, speaking for Buhari. Please don't forget to give us a thumbs up, a like, or share, subscribe. God bless you. Let's get all the details. There are millions of us around the world who follow Buhari passionately. Some got enlisted in 1984 when the man was the military head of state. Others joined alongside as the principal was chairman of the Petroleum Trust Fund in the General Sonia Bacha's years, or when he joined the peasant politics in 2002, ran for president a year later, also in 2007, 2011, and then 2015, the jackpot, when he eventually coast to power. Over the years, some of the Buharis we call have fallen off and even join opposition. Yet, some others have stood still, resolute and constant as the Northern Star stood up and take a bow. We, the people, have embraced Buhari. Even Joe Ibukwe from the north, from Anambra, from the east, I beg your pardon, from the east, Newi, Anambra State precisely, have come to embrace the great man. President Muhammad Buhari is possibly the credible person, politician I have ever seen in this country. Many people have talked about my love and affiliation for the great man, how I write about him weekly in my column, and my literacy as a journalist on my online media tweets and say I claim Buhari is better than Obafemi Awolowo, Nandi Azikiwe, and Aminu Bello and the rest. He succeeded they have succeeded in trying to twist my words. Yes, I said it. Buhari is one of the greatest men who has led Nigeria. He is a very truthful person. Generation hateful comments against me will never change my love for him. But I leave them to God. For we shall all stand before the judgment seat of God to answer. I tell you, since I've been following this man, he is a very professional man, a politician, an ethnic, no ethnic affair to any particular ethnicity. No longer will anybody matter consign me. I am following him wholeheartedly. He is a man for Nigerians. He is a very truthful person, one of the politicians I've seen that means well for Nigeria. I hear all people say about me, but when has it become a crime to love Nigeria, my country, to love Buhari, the man in power, not because of money, and to love Igbo land. I mean, excuse me, why is he Igbo land? What has it got to do with Igbo land? When you look at the whole thing, you understand that Femi, you know, is when the thing gets to you, that you begin to react, right? Yes? If it hasn't gotten to you, you will not react. So, I mean, what he's seeing now, he can see that everybody you know, everybody is just like, like seriously, I mean, this guy, you, 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 you not try, you not do well, you not do well at all. You know, everybody's telling him and he's not even referring to Joe. He say Joe is from Inewi, from Anambra State. I mean, if you are picking on Joe, yeah, is Joe the benchmark to speak of the Igbos that love Buhari? It's not, is it not because, 
you can tell that his own conscience is pricking him already. He knows that, um, I mean, it's not business as usual. Nigerians are not happy. People from his own place are not happy with him. I mean, because they expect that every opportunity you have, especially, you know, with leadership, you should be able to bring about, uh, uh, you know, encourage people, bring about some hope rather than be a man that, you know, stems and bring about things that do not go well. It's sad, but the truth of the matter is some people in leadership do not consider that their position is to affect lives and to make things better. They don't, they don't put that into cons consideration. It's very sad. You see, so these are some of the things going on and um, we're bringing you up to speed and up to date with some of these things. I mean, this is the new, the new normal now where they can do and undo and expect to get away with it and expect people to clap for them at the same time. So what they want Nigerians to do, I can't really tell you. Now, the, the person he can, the only person he can tag along with is Joe. St. Joe is from Newi, is from uh, Anambra State, yet he loves Buhari. Uh, I mean, who are we to question his love for Buhari? Well done, co-lovers -love of Buhari. Well done. I mean, you are doing very well, right? You're doing very well loving Buhari. Continue. You know, he said Buhari is one of the most trusted person, and one of the people that, you know, has never lied. I mean, <laughs> he's doing well for Nigeria. He's quite happy. He's pleased with Buhari. Blah, 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 blah. He knows that people are not happy with him. Or his conduct, he knows. Hence, he's trying to, you know, patronize. I don't know who he's trying to patronize anyway, because we're not buying it. If that's what he wants to do, we're not buying it. And he spoke of love for the southeast. Anyway, my brothers and sisters from the southeast, Joe loves you. Um, what's his name? Femi Adesina loves you. He said there is no crime in loving people from the southeast. Joe loves Buhari, and uh, he himself he loves Buhari. Like anybody cares, like anybody cares. He knows that, he knows what people are saying about him, you see. Leave us a comment, we'd love to hear from you. Please don't forget to like us, share, subscribe. Click on the notification button so you can get all our latest news. God bless you. Have a lovely day. Bye for now. Bye.